everyone, this is Kyle from We Tech Care Review, and today I'm just going to give you a quick overview of the latest enhancement that we've done to the invoice generator, and that's having a dashboard so we've got save for later functionality. Now, I'm just going to do a quick run through of this functionality in the app. Uh, unfortunately, we've not done a tutorial for this video step by step because uh, this did take a lot of extra work to build and we had to do a lot of testing. And I was actually just using this over a couple of months to keep ironing out the bugs. So what I've done is I'll put a link into the description where you can just purchase this full app. Um, but let's just get to the run through. So as you can see, we've got our dashboard screen here. And if I now just select new invoice, so this will take us to the invoice, which you'll have seen um, on this version, which you'll see in the description, what you can purchase is we've got a lookup to your customers. So this is all maintained in a SharePoint list. I've just got two customers in that list at the moment. So if I select test customer, that's then going to populate the address. Um, and if I just add some descriptions, so... So as we can see, that's all calculating okay. So now if I select save for later, that's gonna save that record. That's gonna take me back to the dashboard and there we can see is our invoice that's part generated. So if I go ahead and select that, there we can see it's fully populated again. I can continue with adding more records. So we can add that. And then when we're ready, we can click submit and we'll receive that in that email. Uh, just one more thing I want to show you is now we've successfully submitted that. We've got a drop down at the top here. So it's always set to pending. So we can see the invoices that we've not yet sent. However, now if I just change that to completed, you can see all of those completed invoices that we've sent previously. Now I've just received the generated invoice that gets uh, sent. And if I just open the invoice, there we can see that generated invoice with all the information that we added, all calculated, and that's the final product. Uh, I hope this video helps. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Take care. Thank you. Mm -hmm.